Hey, it's Shayna Berkeley, your neighborhood stylist, your stylist next door, here to teach you how to rock the trends in your real world, and you are watching a video of me thrifting. So if you love thrifting, if you love fashion, if you love ideas of what to wear to work, or just in your life, then this is the right channel for you. Let's go thrifting. Let's just do an outfit check. Okay. I'm just doing like a little color blocking vibe, urban, with my sushi pants, the crew neck, it says music style hip hop everything with a shirt and the pants i thrifted these shoes are so they're from a dance team when i was in college but outfit yeah i'm trying to donate some purses they need help over here they do not have a lot of belts but this is kind of cute red Let's see. oh this one's cool too they're both 2 show how trends repeat themselves like this is probably the original inspiration or you know 90s style for that new Bottega slide that's super popular now this is Liz Claiborne flex okay good ankle boots look cute in good condition any Jimmy Buffett pants Let's see what else they put back soft and sexy okay keep it cute Oh, I don't. I don't know what size they have, but they're nine dollars. Cute. This good wheel is where the trendy shoes go to die. Betsy Johnson. Yeah, I remember those heelless shoes we used to wear. No shade to art teachers. All right, first section in the front is the shoes. So let's do some of those. Yeah, I remember when these were heavy, heavy, okay. Let's see. Some boots here. These are nice. I like those a lot. Hmm. So far, I'm not seeing anything. I'm gonna look on the other aisle. See these. Hmm. Now with. Those are cute now with. I really, I really like these. Look. I'm here for the tap shoes. I wish I knew somebody who needed a tap shoes. They're literally four bucks. I almost just want to donate them to like a dance studio or something. I might do that. I'm going to think about it. Those are cute. I like that design. Who made these? BCBG, of course. Always ahead of the curve. Dress this time. First thing I see is my coat obsession with her long wool coat. You can't tell, but this is navy. Size 14, $8. Baby, this is black and Klein. Okay, look at this. Look at that. $30. I don't know why Anne Klein 30. I mean, she nice, but it's her cousin Julia for seven. That's odd. I love them. You've made it thus far. So that means you like it. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe, honey. As so many of you guys are watching and not subscribing, and I don't know why. <laughs> subscribe and comment below your favorite thing that you saw or if you like this style of video. I want to make sure it's something that's super fun for you guys. So, okay, let's get back to this video. No dresses here for me, but I want to show you something that I like. I like this one because of that ribbing and the stones. Um, this is a black one shoulder dress. Look at those little bows. That's cute. Like a satin, have a belt. Very 90s, but cute. I used to own this dress. It's from Target. Who what wear collection? Uh oh. Next is. This would be cute for like a wedding or something. Look at that. And maybe like a flapper party. We are going into the roaring 20s, hopefully. So we got that. And look at this like knockoff Irving. We all used to wear them. 
just a nice little soda dress here. And look at the front of this one. It is a Lily Pulitzer dress. Kind of looks like a cake. I like that. It's a little yellowed out. But I thought it was cute. Then look at this. I'm black and black. Okay. Let's see this one. A new day. That's cute. And then this is Zara. Kind of a thin chocolate brown dress with the knot. In the front. Hey, question. Do y'all think these dresses are going to come back? I hope not. But these kinds of tops are, so we'll see. Guys, I stepped in the back to tell you this. You guys wouldn't do this, so, you know, if you have a family member, a friend that goes thrifting, just remind them. Not only is it rude to be, if I'm at this dress, you to be at this dress. It's generally rude. You're generally too close to me. And I understand that some people don't have a sense of personal space, but we're in a pandemic. Why are you so close to me? I'm trying to be nice, but you're very close. I literally stood there like, D do you want this dress? Because you're so close to me. Yeah, like you can't wait till I move. I don't want it. Okay. <sighs> Back to the happy time. Guys, look at this. It's got to be an old H&M tag, but it's a little drop waist knit dress. Yeah, I know I'm thirsty for it. <laughs> it might be a little too cheap looking. Um, it's also size small, so bye, girl. Just want to show you that you can find things like this. It's actually on sale at H&M right now. Originally, Forever 21 at the thrift store for six bucks and lastly doesn't this look like a cute little collegiate like if you put like a letterman letter on here or something that could be a cute vibe here's the original twin set okay some of them used to be made together this is both long sleeve look like y'all know about that oh look what i found yeah animal print go on with me i think but this is cute etc Nice blazer. And then the 2XL, like, I like a linen blend, double breasted blazer. Also nice. More jackets, a little fur INC number, which is actually really cute. Um, I really like this blazer. Look at the stitching. This is the only thing that has this little. I probably could get it out, I'm not sure. Let me try it on. And that. But shirt, I like that neon color. This is just a vest or a gilet, whatever you want to call it. It'd be cute over just some jeans and a cute shirt. This is a Rockin' Republic size 12 blazer. No, I don't like this blazer, but I like the color and I like this little detail in the back. And last thing, I like this waterfall blazer and I like the neon color. So, neons, people, get with it. Neons. All right, I'm gonna just show you some new things. This is another nice linen blazer. It's from my Burr Herbe Bernard. I love this. I'm trying to decide if I should just get it for a future client. I don't even know who will wear it. It's a size six, but look at the closure. And then it's the Hari. Nobody really wears skirt suits like that, but I just think it's so nice. It's so dollars. So I'm thinking about it. I have another client who would actually wear this. Well, she could fit this rather, but I'm trying to tell if it's her style, Ellen Tracy. I don't know. I like it though. Forever 21. Look at this vintage jacket with the lapels. One of the buttons is missing. But I think it's so cool. I actually have some pants that'll match that, but that jacket's too small for me. Somebody grab it out of J. Crew jacket though. Both of these J. Crew. So, just more things. All right, just some things I found in the sweaters. I thought this was interesting, and it had a zipper of the front instead of buttons. Leopard print. This is a Walmart brand, though. Um, nothing wrong with it, but you could probably get it at Walmart for $6. I don't know. Walmart been popping lately. This is a Target brand. Animal print. Um, I just like the cow neck of this. Very, like, nautical. Again, the cardigan trend is huge, so I'm trying to show you that you can find it here. And every variation every size that got it for you even this is cute right large 
those little girls like who can wear like Bella Hadid and wear open and they have like a um, bando on and high waist jeans. Y'all could be cute. Boohoo, size eight, like a moto jacket. Another just sweater, another sweater, but look, three X. So you can find your size up in here. A shrunken sweater, very Barbie girl. Um, another one in the pink, I like the color. Uh-oh. Turquoise and then a purple long knit, which is super pretty. I just don't wear long knits enough to need it. I'm sure I know about the shine down, shine down, okay? It's a nice color. Some people are like really into Christmas and they're just shopping for a year round. And so this the elf themed sweater that'd be cute. It was never worn for six dollars. On the back it has this, which is funny. Um, also if you're more of just a winter wonderland kind of person, that sort of like that. Uh, if you're my Y2K girls into BB, original BB shirt. If you're into a cozy reversible number. I like the animal print colors on this. And then lastly, this is a sleeveless sweater, which is all the rage right now. So this is obviously a vintage one, but still. See, Christmas people, I told you, shop in March. At this point, it's obvious. Next is, I like this because it's already cropped. It says, I'm fine, thank you. Which also reminds us to ask how people are doing. I hate when people don't know do that. Inspire others, a 3X, or 1820s are um, just long, cute shirt. Could be a good workout shirt, too. A sheer lace. You just put, like, a tank top on under it. This is from Worthington. It has, you know, butterflies and pretty pictures. Could you imagine this shirt with some, like, a navy blue suit? Ooh, that would be cute. And then this watercolor dress, because I thought it was pretty. It's from Harper and Gray. And then lastly, this little vintage jacket. These are in the men's department, but they would be so cute on a woman. And like they have the best top pleating with these belt loops. Like these are phenomenal. They might actually be women's, I don't know. Um, but this is a big trend. I'll insert a picture or two and how you can wear these. Look at this reversible trench coat. I don't need it, but I want it. I'm not going to get it though. It's $7. But this is so nice. Look at that. Isn't it the coolest? So if you're a designer, this is a good idea. Next is just a double-breasted navy blazer that has really cute buttons. If I could show them to you, that'd be nice. Really cute buttons. And then this oversized, crazy good shoulder pad by Joan Walters. $8. In the middle right. That's just a cool pattern. I feel like an incline coat. It's a cool pattern. Let's see what else I got in here. Oh, this could be a cute summer dress. I'm gonna unroll it and see. Tada if you're into it. Let's see. A free people sweater, but that looks kind of beat up. Two of them actually, the exact same one. Okay, now. Do y'all remember these skirts? Oh my god, I used to have this skirt. <laughs> I used to have this skirt. Yes, I would and would still wear a skirt that makes noise. Somebody done a whole collection of these skirts. I kind of like them. I think that's all. This is the only leather jacket I've found, which is surprising. It's cute though, it's $15. Really love it, and I like the back. It's like the vent back there. Definitely a vintage vibe with shoulder pads in the men's department, but I don't need it, but I like it. Let's see what else they got. Oh, here's a little sweater vest. American Eagle. I also saw this, which I like. It says Signs of Light. And it's in the head and the heart, which is cute. And then this, which I don't know if I'll wear, which is why I'm hesitant about getting it. But like, it's so cute. Both $6.99. So 
Uh, got a predator sweatshirt, obligatory natural thing. Um, this is a size large, a really cute summer top. I like velvet, so this was cute to me. Purple velvet button there. If you're into like those sheer vintage tops, I have one in black. You would have seen in another video. And a Calvin Klein jeans denim button down. This is not a very nice workout top. Child, I don't work out, but this one was cute. Animal print, vintage Liz Claiborne. I like the material. I'm thinking about it, but it's a medium. So I'm thinking of button over my boobs. Um, what's this? I just wanted to show y'all this is another two-piece twin set. I'm trying to tell y'all origin stories over here. I just thought that might be kind of cool. Somebody could dress it cute. More animal print, but in the yellow, let's guess. Brooks Brothers, good, like new, blush pink button down. This little sweatshirt is cute, it says Shine Bright. It's from, I don't know what it's called. A bomber jacket from, I think No Boundaries is Walmart too, right? Another denim shirt from Gap, and it has like the little western flare on the sides. I know some of my followers really like the denim on denim, which I do too. And I have a video about the Canadian tuxedo. If you do, you should check it out. Um, Ralph Lauren extra large blouse for, I don't know, but it's probably about $6. Cute. Oh, navy, another blush button down. Another gap denim button down with a different style, the single pocket. I'm just trying to show you guys the variations of things at the store. And it was five dollars. An Adidas pullover for five dollars. This is a Hanes sweatshirt. I like the color and the sleeves. This is like a little wrap top, which is actually pretty cute. A good material, that black and white. Great for color blocking. Buffalo check with the little flouncy sleeves there. This is. I should turn it around so you can see. A Michael Kors top, very resort wear feeling. And then this long button front dress that can be worn open like a vest, or I really like that you can style that lots of different ways. So those are some more finds. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you wanna see more videos like this, comment below, tell me what you love about it, tell me what you like to see, and I'll make more content like that. Again, I'm Shana Berkeley, your neighborhood stylist, your stylist next door, here to teach you how to rock the trends in your real world. And don't forget, after this video, I have so many more for you. So go ahead and click the end screen, watch another video, and then if you don't love me, fine, you don't have to subscribe. But if you do, subscribe and join me every Monday and Friday because I want you to love your Mondays as much as your Fridays. Have a good day.